good morning and very good afternoon and very good evening to you, the good and wonderful people of the tube. Hope you are well today. Hope you're feeling grand as usual. Can you tell I am? What is this that stands before me? <laughs> get the idea that I might be a little bit hyper. Yes, your eyes do not deceive you. It is a Telecaster, everybody, but a very extremely special Telecaster made by Master Nick Oswald of Oswald Guitars. You don't need, he doesn't need much of an introduction, I don't think, on this channel. I don't think he needs any introduction on this channel. Everyone knows the man, the myth, the legend that is Mr. Nick. So, Yes. Let's talk about this, shall we? Quick, before we start getting into noises. I did a Q&A uh, a while back now, about a month, few months ago. And uh, somebody said, when are you going to start, you know, are you ever going to you, you get a Telecaster, you know, and use Telecasters in your videos? And I was like, well, I'd like to, but I've never found one that works for me. I find them a bit clumsy. I find them too heavy. I'm not... I'm not comfy with them because they're quite big and blocky. Anyway, the legend that is Mr. Nick Oswald, everybody, um, messaged me saying, I'll build you one. And I said, I, I can't, I would love an Oswald Telecaster, but I can't, I, I can't afford it. And, you know, I, I just can't, I, right now I just can't afford it. And he goes, don't worry, he says, this one's for free. I mean, what?! If that man is not the, the, the most generous, legendary human being on the planet, I don't know who is. So, we started talking about what I wanted out of a Telecaster. And I wanted a... I've always loved the 1950s black guard tellies. The yellow with the black scratch plate and the maple neck. I've always wanted one. I always want... That's my dream Telecaster. I've owned a Tele Custom. I've owned another Sunburst and, and some other ones here and there, but I've never owned a yellow one, and I've always wanted one. So, we got talking about that, and that's what we decided on. Maple neck, uh, vintage kind of uh, yellow body, and I got to pick a headstock, which is you know, the classic kind of Telecaster headstock. But I said, is it possible to put Strat chamfers and cutaways on the Telecaster? And Nick was obviously like, yes, of course it is. What are you on about, you madman? Of course. I'm Nick Oswald, I can do anything. Anyway, <laughs> sorry Nick. But, um, but yeah, I said, is it possible to kind of put you know, the arm thing on it and the belly cut? And he was like, yeah, I can do that. And I said, is it possible to make it strap thickness as well? Because a Telecaster, I've always had a problem with Telecaster being like too fat and I always kind of feel they kind of sit off me dead fine. I don't like it, it feels weird. And he was like, yeah, so it's trimmed the body. Uh, so this is the body that he made and it's, Really, really thin. Well, let's put it that way. Hope you'll be able to see. There we go. Um, so it's really thin. It's strap thin. It's the, it's the thickness of a strap. And then we have the belly cut there, which is gorgeous. And the arm uh, weight as well. And as soon as I got this guitar and plugged it in and played it, I was like, that's it. That's what's been missing from Telecasters since I started wanting a Telecaster, since I, I like, you know, I need a Telecaster, that's what's missing. It's the Strat cutaways, as much as that, you know, that's maybe not the thing to have, but, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm overly excited, I bet you can't tell. Anyway, I'm hyper as a, I'm high as a kite. So he put them in, and as soon as I picked it up and played it, I was like, that's it. That's it. That's, 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 that's what I, that's it, that's the feel. And then it, it got even better. So not only did he put, like, the body down to the thickness I wanted and the, the belly cut and the arm chamfer down and make it look exactly how I wanted it to do. He relicked it as well. It, the lacquer's all checked. You can see all the lacquer checking. The lacquer's sunk into the wood grain. It's awesome. Let's move on to the neck. Sorry, I will get to playing in a minute, everybody, but I need to talk about it first. So I hope you don't mind. The neck is a carb, well, it's as close copy of my white strat 
as you can get, and it feels identical. It's scary close. Um, I just sent, I sent Nick measurements of my white Strat's neck, and it's it's just identical. It's absolutely identical. It's weird, because I if I close my eyes and play, it feels I could be holding my white Strat. If it wasn't for this part, feeling this part there, I I don't know if I would know. It's one of those really creepy things. It's absolutely spot on. So that's the neck. Now let's talk about the pickups before... We, well, let's talk about pickups and make some noise. So it's a standard telly wire and there isn't any kind of crazy wire and I just wanted it straightforward as, and as simple as possible. Look at... Let me just show you the back quick. Um, on. Can you see the wood grain on that? There's the belly cut and there's the arm chamfer. But hopefully we'll be able to see this. All the all the all the lacquer sunk into the wood grain, and it's just in in it's uh, I. He's given me my Telecaster. Nick has given me my Telecaster, and I will have this guitar for the rest of my life now. No ifs, no buts, no questions asked. It's mine for it's going to be mine forever. I'm never going to sell it. I'm not going to be interested in selling it. And I'm going to play it, and I'm going to. I actually haven't put it down since I got it. Uh, I put a little teaser picture up on um, my Instagram, Facebook, and, and on, on, on YouTube as well. And I put one up um, uh, on Thursday, sorry, as well, about this guitar. And it was you know, a bit cryptic, just like little spots here and there. But <sighs> Okay, so let's talk about the pickups, because Nick has wound these himself. So these are Nick Oswald Telly... Uh, pickups, which you can buy from him. They will be on his website. Website is in the description box below. You can buy these Telecaster pickups and they are stunning. Especially both on together. But let's start with the bridge Tele pickup. This has just got that Tele thing. It's just got that thing, it's just... distortion on it's huge but still has that clarity has, has, has a lot of clarity still I don't know where that came from, but hey, it's fun. Okay, so that's the bridge pick, but it does exactly that thing I want from a Telecaster. That snap, and it's got that real, it's got this awesome kind of bluesy kind of sound. If I had to put the governor on its own, I'm gonna hyperventilate before the end of this video, everyone. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
There's nothing more to say. That's the bridge pickup. That just sounds like heaven. That's just that telecaster set. That's that telecaster that I wanted and I have. In a telecaster I can play! Nick, you're gonna kill me. But the word thank you isn't enough. Okay, so now both pickups on. And this seems to me to have that real Jimmy Page quack. That <laughs> telecaster quack. <laughs> So yeah, it's got that thing. It's If my smile gets any bigger, I'm going to have a joker eventually. My face is going to rip open. Okay, so that's the both on together. And that's just, it's just, yes. Yes, yes. And double yes on the neck.
<sighs> when guitars attack. What am I doing? Checking if it's in tune. Of course it's in tune apart from drop D. Who ever heard of a Telecaster going out of tune? I tell ya, after a nuclear war there will be cockroaches and Telecasters breeding in some kind of... Telecock. That's wrong. Anyway! <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I, I don't want to talk anymore. I'm just going to play. I'm just going to play now, everybody. So, Nick, you beautiful man, you. This, not only have I got that John Fashanti inspired 50 strap from you, you also gave me the gift of this. And this is beyond anything I could ever imagine. And it's just, Perfect. Absolutely perfect. It's the Telecaster I've dreamt about since I've wanted a Telecaster, and that's been a long time. And it's been a long time coming, but I finally have a Telecaster to use in videos, everybody, and you will see it tons. Because I love it. And it's amazing, and it plays great, and it feels great, and it just is great. Okay, everybody. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I haven't waffled on too much. Because it's a Telecaster, and I've been playing a bit of Jeff Buckley, let's play some more Jeff to finish on, shall we? But I need a capo, so I'll be back in a sec. But, uh, Nick, thank you so much for this. I can't... I, it, thank you is too small of a word. It, word, it really is. And I just... Yeah, I can't thank you enough. It's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Nick Oswald, everybody. I can't say any more. I can't say any more. That man is a god among men. And his guitars he builds are incredible. And when you see this thing up close and you play it, which hopefully, if I ever get to that point where we're doing meet and greets and, and going around doing gigs and whatnot, you'll love it as well. So yeah, everybody, the Oswald telly that, that I can't, I don't have any more words. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again very soon. Have a great weekend, everybody. I certainly will. I've got two gigs in one day and this is getting used at both of them. It's going to be an Oswald extravaganza tomorrow. I'm going to take the Oswald John Strat and this and use both. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. I'll see you again. Have a great morning, afternoon, evening. Goodbye now. Thank you very much.